There is an animal out there that needs to die in order to live. Hi, thank you so much for tuning in. Jeff here, and I will be introducing you today to 10 of the greatest hibernators this world has to offer. And if you think hibernation is just a bear going into a cave to sleep off the winter, oh, oh there is way more to it, including one animal like we mentioned that actually passes away. Am I dead? Not yet. Now, as for why these creatures do this at all, hibernation is essential to survival. It's a way for animals to conserve energy, to survive adverse weather conditions, or if there's a lack of food. And believe me when I say that there are creatures out there that are pros to sleeping off the winter blues. But before we jump in, if you are new to the channel, go ahead and hit subscribe so you don't miss out on future night owls, early birds, and every creature in between. Okay, now that you're dialed in, let's take a look at these top 10 sleepers. Number 10, bears. While bears are probably one of the first animals you think of when you think of hibernation, they don't actually hibernate. What? Well, not in the true sense at least. Bears go into a state called torpor, which while similar to hibernation, is different. When in torpor, bears reduce both their heart and breathing rate, and their body temperature drops but less so than animals that actually hibernate. What? When in torpor, bears can and do wake up easily, but they go for days without waking, eating, drinking, or going to the toilet. Number nine, garter snakes. While many animals that do hibernate do it alone, hibernation in garter snakes is a group activity. Hundreds or perhaps even thousands of snakes come together in a den to hibernate. The close contact helps them to keep warm, which is important for cold-blooded animals, such as lizards and, you guessed it, snakes. <laughs> Number 8. Fox Turtles Many turtles hibernate, but it varies with species and location. Box turtles can hibernate for between 3 to 5 months a year. They dig themselves an underground burrow, lower their heart rate to 5 to 10 beats per minute, and stop breathing completely. Now, although they do stop breathing, they don't go without oxygen, because their body is built in such a way that they can take in air through their skin. Number 7. Snails Now, snails might not be the first creature you think of when you think of hibernation. Oh, absolutely not. No, no, no. But some do. When they hibernate, snails retreat into their shells and seal off the entrance with mucus to keep in moisture and to stop them from drying out. They don't just do this in cold weather either. They also protect themselves from hot weather too. Although when they do it for this reason, it is called estivation. Number six, marmots. Now I don't know about you, but if it wasn't for missing out on Christmas, I would sleep all the way through winter. Well, marmots are the lucky animals that actually can do this, or at least they hibernate through winter. Sometimes this hibernation can last up to eight months at a time. When hibernating, marmots can reduce their heart rate to three to four beats per minute, and will only take two to three breaths in that same amount of time. Number five, common poor will. There is a reason that you don't really hear about birds hibernating, and that's because most of them really don't. The common poor will is the only one, and it does so because its insect food source is unavailable for the winter. Rather than migrate, the birds snuggle in a hollow log and wait out the winter by lowering their metabolic rate and hibernating. I mean, I get it. Who wants to fly all the way south for the winter? Number four, bats. Much like bears, bats go into a state of torpor, or a reduced hibernation. They do this overnight when temperatures drop too low or when food becomes scarce. Some species of bats actually do take this a step further and truly hibernate over the winter. But generally, these bats are the ones that live in areas where insects are less available during the winter months. When in torpor or hibernating, bats huddle together from ceilings or cave walls and can reduce their heart rate to 10 beats per minute. Number three, hedgehogs. Hedgehogs can hibernate for weeks or even months depending on how cold the winter gets. 
During hibernation, hedgehogs can drop their heart rate by up to 90%, but may wake up briefly if it gets too cold. Wake up, wake up! The increased heart rate when they wake up warms them up just enough so that they can hunker back down and catch a lot more of those drawn out Zs. <laughs> Number two, bumblebees. Not all bees hibernate, but for the bumblebee, hibernation is a part of life. Or at least it is for the queen. Long live the queen. All males and worker bees die off when the temperatures drop, leaving the queen to find a suitable spot to wait out the winter. When temperatures rise, the queen emerges, builds a nest, and lays a whole new colony ready to get to work. Now before we go over the number one spot, here's some honorable mentions. The deer mice, the skunk, and the ladybug. Now let's cover an animal that's not afraid to go a little extreme. Number one, wood frogs. Wood frogs go one step further than most animals when it comes to hibernation. They not only stop breathing completely, but their heart comes to a complete halt. In fact, they cool down so much that their blood freezes, crystallizing into actual ice. They bed down in logs, burrows, or leaf piles for winter, and then let the freeze take them. At the beginning of winter, ice quickly fills the wood frog's abdominal cavity and encases the internal organs. Ice crystals form between layers of skin and muscle. Even their eyes turn white because the lenses freeze. And now it's just a waiting game. They remain there all winter in that exact same spot until the temperatures get just high enough for their bodies to warm up and they begin breathing once again. And that right there is some of the world's heaviest sleepers. So do you wish you could sleep away the winter? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to smash that like button. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time as we cover 10 more Ultimate Animals.